Word to the wise. Ignore your haters and remove your takers. I'm going to tell you like this. Whether it's today, whether it's tomorrow, whether it's later on in this week, you are going to probably find out that someone hated on you. You're going to get the news. And you're either going to feel some type of way about it, sad down in the dumps, or you're going to do what you should do and ignore it, or use it as fuel to drive you to make sure you prove that hater wrong. They only hating on you because they wish they were you. They only hating on you because they know you're doing great things. They know you're doing phenomenal things. If they ain't hating, then you probably not doing something right. So let this serve as your hater repellent for the day. Matter of fact, let it serve as your hater repellent for your life. And you let them know, if you hating, I ain't relating. So you gotta keep them boxing gloves ready. So you can knock them haters out with a power punch of massive success. We don't got no time for no haters. We understand, they will be there. They will be, yep, 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 yep. We don't got time for that, yep. All they doing is talking. While they're talking, we're doing. While they're resting, we're taking action. So we understand it's part of the territory. So therefore, their words, we render them powerless. They had the words, but we had a power. Never forget that. Haters mean nothing to you. I know your haters are lurking, but you can't even hear them because you're too busy grinding hard and working. Now that we can kick those haters to the curb, you need to come up with a plan for those takers in your life. Because you keep giving and you keep giving and you keep giving all of you. And they have absolutely no problem taking. It's time for you to stand up for yourself. Because they take your heart. They try to take your soul. They try to take your mind. They take your money. They take your time. And they try to take your spirit. This is the moment that you say, listen, Stop. And you say, no, I refuse to be a doormat. I refuse to be a doorstop for you. It all stops right now. We're going to create a win-win situation or there will be absolutely no situation at all. So you got to come up with a plan. Because you're a giver. And that's probably just who you are. And that means you got to set limits. Because I promise you, the takers never do. They will keep taking and taking and taking and taking and taking if you keep giving and giving and giving. But no more, no longer, you gotta get rid of those blood sucking leeches because they will suck you dry. And they know it. So they play on who you are. They play on your innocence. They play on your emotions. That's the bad news. The good news is you have an opportunity to change that. You have the power to change that. So this is the perfect time for you to come up with a plan to remove yourself from that one-sided friendship, from that one-sided relationship where you are the only one putting in the effort. I need you to take that effort and get yourself out of that situation and remove that toxic person or those toxic people from your life. Enough of the giving enough of allowing them to take and use and abuse you and steal your joy and your peace of mind if it's not a win-win like I said earlier it doesn't exist so ignore your haters and remove your takers and put yourself in a position to climb over the hump and make each and every day of your life a Wednesday Remember, you are an unbreakable force. And I want to see you happy. This is a great day to win. Let's go.